you dig a tunnel between any two points, no matter how far those points may be, after jumping in it will always take exactly 90 minutes for you to jump out on the other side. No matter if you're traveling across Europe, the US or even through Earth's entire diameter, your travel time stays relatively the same. For linear motion and traveling on the surface of the Earth, it seems very intuitive to assume that the change in distance is always directly proportional to the change of time. However, as you fall deeper into Earth, gravity itself begins to change. Think about it this way. When you fall directly through Earth's center, gravity pulls you straight down, accelerating you rapidly. But when your path is shorter and doesn't pierce the center, gravity doesn't pull you directly along your path. It's angled, providing less acceleration. This creates a perfect balancing act. Shorter paths provide weaker gravitational acceleration, while longer distances experience stronger pull that increases your velocity significantly and then slows you down after passing the midpoint. This balance is exactly enough to keep the time of travel fixed at approximately 90 minutes. 